Yemi Sholade, a Nigerian actor, says Twitter went too far insulting President Muhammad Buhari and the country at large by deleting his tweet. Please be new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any update from this channel. Twitter had earlier deleted Buhari's tweet wherein he spoke about the civil war experience and threatened to deal with those bent on destroying Nigeria through insurrection. The development had culminated into the eventual suspension of the microblocking site by the federal government for the pastel use of the platform for activities that are capable of undermining Nigeria's corporate existence. The suspension has continued to spark widespread outrage with many Nigerians, including celebrities, condemning the move. But in a now viral video, Yemi Sholadi appeared to be backing the government's suspension of the social media platform. He also accused Twitter of trying to foment trouble and anarchy in Nigeria. The actor said the president's tweet was merely an expression of his thought, noting that Twitter was wrong to have deleted it. It, that is Barry's deleted tweet, is just an expression of, of for all I care. It's something that is coming from everyone's fundamental human right to express. Even at that, I will not subscribe to malicious posts and hate speech. Nobody thought Twitter was going to be banned. Everybody thought it was a huge joke, he said during an interview with Goldman TV. I think Twitter went too far, insulted the president of Nigeria, and by extension all of force, some 200 million people of Nigeria. I think about 45% of the subscribers, more or less, Nigerians, make Twitter very thick. This is not the first time Twitter will attempt to humiliate Nigerians. It's happened to Pastor Chris Oyakulobe. As much as I am of the opinion that everybody has right to expression and thought, but then when a platform is used to foment trouble or want to project anarchy, there should be rules regulating such practices.